South Africa's embattled police chief is facing more trouble, this time from the country's government. Ria Piega already has been suspended in connection with her role in the so-called Marikana massacre. Now, the police minister has accused her of crimes, including perjury and fraud, of which Piega has yet to respond to. CCTV Zolisa Njamela has a story. A ministerial task team investigating problems in the police service has laid most of the blame at the door of suspended National Commissioner Ria Piecha. Piecha has been accused of perjury, fraud, misconduct and wasteful expenditure. That's according to Police Minister Ngozi Nati Ntleko. Some predict she could face prosecution. It's quite likely that she may face uh, criminal charges if those allegations uh, are found to be true based on the work of these task teams. Piecha already is in deep trouble over the Marikana massacre in 2012 when police shot dead 34 striking mine workers. She had only just taken charge at the time. But Piecha was suspended last month over her testimony before an official inquiry. She now faces a new inquiry into her fitness for office. The South African Police Union says the next commissioner of chief should come from the service itself. Piecha was hired from the private sector. Now it is an opportunity for a career cop, a career police officer who have got the basics about policy, but will only apply the technical decisions at that level, which suits that office. Some have called on Piecha to resign voluntarily, saying the police need to make a clean break under new leadership. The image of the police in this country has over the years been badly damaged and critics agree that whatever happens next, that image has to be restored as a matter of urgency. Yolisan Jamela, CCTV in Pretoria, South Africa.